Yo, what is up, guys? Welcome back to another video. It's your boy, Unkillable Gamer 26 here, back with another video, and I'm here with your boy, Dark Z3, up in the corner on Zoom. Yeah. So, pretty much, as you've seen the title of this video, um, I am a hip hop head. I do like Eminem, rap, uh, fast beat music, all that good jazz. And but uh, but uh, Dark Z3 up here is more of a, a heavy metal dude. Um, so I'm gonna be reacting to some of his songs that he has for me. I have not heard these songs like ever, um, so I don't know what they're gonna sound like. I don't know what the, what's happening. All I know is it's gonna be some heavy metal probably. So let's get right into it. Um, first we have a song called From Ashes to New. Um, Land of Make Believe. The band is from Ashes to New. Yeah, the band is from Ashes to New, and the song is Land Me Land of Make Believe. English is, is difficult. Um, but yeah, so that's what we're gonna be reacting to. And I have two more songs um, I'm gonna be reacting to besides this one. And so yeah, also just for copyright reasons, um, the owners of these songs from Ashes to New, all stuff goes to them. All right. <clears throat> Alright, well, just making sure, because all that good jazz. But anyway, I know you guys are here for the music, not to listen to me babble on. So, let's just, uh, let's just start it up. You stand there all alone and try to think of what I said. But there's a familiar talk just keeps on ringing in your head. Everything you've known is more to bring it to an end. The situation that you're in is your creation and it's dead. It's what it is and nothing is to see. You talk is nothing, can you bring it more to love and this and that is why it's coming. So, uh, as you can see, just a minute in here. I also, obviously, it's very heavy metal. I don't have my volume up the whole way either. For obvious reasons. Um, but yeah. So, overall, it's it's not bad. I don't know. I just, I like hearing the words as they're said. You can tell, kind of, there's like a little bit of rap in it, too. Like, the other songs, they're, they're very heavy, like, rap, kind of, in the verses. But it's, it's kind of a mix of both. Yeah, yeah, that's, uh, some bands like to go full heavy metal, then there's bands like these that'll go, like, some rap and some, um, heavy metal, and then there's just full on rap. Hey guys, so, yeah, a uh, little bit of technical issues, I forgot to share the screen with, with your boy, um, but it's fine. Uh, so, yeah, uh, overall it's not bad, like, I, I've, I have, I do listen to some heavy metal here and there, but not too often. Um, yeah, like I said, I'm more of a rap guy, uh. But yeah, I like the style. I like the type of wording that they use. I like the analogies that they kind of throw in there once in a while. It's, uh, it's a bit, I don't know, it's just clean. It's clean. I like it.
breakdown to the best part of their song. Like, I really like their breakdown. Yeah. Yeah. yeah I, I'm happy I'm waiting for Freddy Krueger to pop up. <laughs> yeah, uh, it... You can tell that there's definitely emotion towards it. Uh, yeah. it's... It's also... Yeah, God. It's also, like, very vulgar. Yeah. Uh, and it... Uh, it just... It's not it's not bad. I don't, I don't really have anything bad to say about it. I don't really have anything good to say about it. Yeah. Uh, um, they they were interviewed, and they were asked what the song is about, and it's just people who thought they were better than them. So that, like, that's the emotion behind it. True. Well, overall, I'd give the song about, like, a 6, 7 out of 10. I mean, it's not the best thing I've ever heard. It's not the worst thing. Yeah. The worst thing yeah, about it... Oh, go ahead. I feel like the other ones, like the next ones, more because they're more rap. Like their verses are really rap. E, like I don't know how else to put it, but yeah. One, yeah. The one thing I didn't really like about this was that the music, along with the fast like singing, it was hard to understand it without the lyrics. Yeah. And even how fast the lyrics went, like you'd have to listen to the song multiple times to even know what they're saying, mm -hmm. which is not a bad thing, but it it's. I don't know, it's just... I mean, like, come on, yeah, it's the same thing with Eminem. You have to listen to him multiple times to know what he's saying. <laughs> well, yeah, but he's not, like... He doesn't, like, bash music in the background while trying to yeah. speak really fast. He's more of, like, a... Yeah, he doesn't... He's not, like, heavy metal. But overall, the song's not bad. I like it. I like the beat that it has to it. Um, but, yeah, now moving on to the next song that we have. Uh, we have From Ashes to New. Um... Destruction of Myself. Um, this will be interesting. I close my eyes and make believe I'm anywhere but here. It grows inside and makes me see I'm nowhere even there. Although I try, there's no rewind. I cannot disappear. I think it's time that I realize it's me inside that mirror. Cause everything I do reflects on me, and every breath I choose affects me deep. Scars from the wounds I've left on me. Only I took the shoes to get the best of me. Nothing's ever new, made a mess of me. It's all I ever do is oppressing me. I'm out of the truth to the best degree, but it's never. So just a little bit of two minutes over the song. The song's three minutes and forty seconds. Um, it, it's it's okay. I mean, it, it's not. This is less heavy metal, I guess, and more rap, yeah. like you said. Uh, it, the chorus is rap, um, or not? They're not rap, but heavy metal, and the the lines are rap. Would you say you like more the first song or this one? That I like more. Yeah. Um. I'd have to go with the first one, actually. Um, I just like... This one doesn't have as much of a beat to it. It doesn't have, like, yeah. as much of a sound uh, as this as this one does. Or the other one does, but... This one kind of has... It doesn't have to have the sound in it. It's mainly trying... I guess it's mainly trying to focus on, like, saying stuff. And, yeah, like... Meaning. Yeah, meaning and telling people this, that, and whatnot. Instead of just, like, blasting music in the background. But... Yeah. 
yeah, I can definitely, I can definitely say that I like the other one better. But this one, again, like, what do you expect? This one's more of a song that I would put on like when I'm relaxing, while the other one is something like that I do when I'm like working out or whatever. Yeah, yeah. Um, but overall, not bad, not bad. Okay, that part I really liked. I don't know why, but that that just it was I liked it. It was nice. It was different. Yeah, compared to what I've heard so far. Yeah, it's different. I liked it. But all right, so that's from Ashes to New Destruction myself. No, I'm not no, I'm not listening to the full entire song as you can see here. There's like it's just, it's just the chorus at the end. Yeah, yeah, it's just like a minute. There's like maybe like 45 seconds left. Um but uh, moving on to the next song I have from Ashes to New, uh, I will show you. This one has uh, the other Ashes to New. I think it was called like Destruction something. Yeah, it's in the same album. Um, mm. You'll definitely like this one more. I feel like because it's fast rap, kind of like Eminem, like those like the they they have three vocalists: the screamer, the singer, and the rapper. And the rapper is like a fan of Eminem, so he's definitely ha has has Eminem vibes in this one. Oh, okay. All right, well, this one's only three minutes and 11 seconds long, so we'll see. Uh, two minutes in here um i uh, i can definitely see why you'd think i'd like this one more yeah. it definitely has it definitely has a lot more of an uh eminem vibe a lot more of a uh of just rap in it yeah. um hmm. i don't know it's just the background music man i don't i don't care for it i really don't you're loud no, it's not loud enough. <laughs> uh, it's too. It's too meta. It's too. It's like, it sounds like he's trying to tear into it, but the background music just doesn't really, 
doesn't, I don't know, it just doesn't respond well with what he's trying to say, I don't think. Yeah. Hmm. Like, with the other one, you could tell it was heartfelt and how, like, the, like, with the first one, it was heartfelt, heavy music, like, heavy lyrics, it was just overall, it fit, fit, it, it went well together, pretty much, is what I'm trying to say. It went really well together. Um, but, yeah. So, uh, I mean, overall, uh, I'd give this one maybe, like, a 6 out of 10. I'd give the first one, like, at least a 6, 7, or 8, probably a 7 or 8, or 7.5. And the second one, I would give it a maybe 6. Same with this one. I mean, it's not as good as something like um, When I'm Gone by Eminem or something like that, because that's heartfelt. The music's good. The lyrics are good. The music is, the video is good. Like, all of it's just, it just, it's good. Um, and I am new to this, so I don't know if these are, like, the best songs or, like, what? Uh, I would, like, these are, like, probably, like, some of my top five. Um, none of these songs are on my top three. Uh, maybe next time we do this, I'll show you my top three. And, you know, maybe, maybe you'll like them. Mm -hmm. But, uh, yeah, these are, like, my top five. Yeah, but overall, they weren't bad. They weren't, like, horrible. They weren't, like, a one or a two, but they weren't, like, a top, top tier, um, obviously. They, I don't think any of them were going to be a top tier. I mean, I like I like heavy metal, but I don't like it that much. Um, but, yeah, guys, I think that's going to do it for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you did like the video, then uh, consider leaving a like, subscribe, go check out Dark Z3 channels, link in the description. And, yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Peace yeah. out.